Hi everybody, my name is Sean Fury and I'm the owner of Life Management Coaching Solutions uh, located here in Waterville. Um, I just wanted to take a couple minutes to tell you about what it is that we do at the Life Management Training Center um, and why we're doing it. Basically, the idea is that um, everybody wants what Aristotle, famous Greek philosopher, used to call the good life. But the problem is that so many people don't know how to get the good life. Um, and the reason for that is that, like myself, you might have grown up with parents who were very well intentioned, but maybe they didn't have the practical knowledge and skills that it takes to create and sustain a life worth living. Uh, what I call, and other people have referred to as, your best life. Um, so, Basically, growing up in a household where one or more of the parents might be abusive or addicted to drugs or alcohol, chances are you were taught as a child to conform to their uh, way of doing things, which would mean you weren't allowed to develop your own sense of self. Um, usually you're not allowed to express yourself freely, which uh, of course would prevent you from being able to be real, be authentic. and so the problem is that well you might have learned to like stifle your feelings uh, not tell what you really think not really try to achieve your goals because it might have upset one of your parents or maybe they might have given you a aversive consequence or a punishment for doing well right um telling you what do you think you're better than other people what do you think you're somebody special when really you are somebody special and everyone is you know, very um, valuable in their own way. But growing up in those households, you tend to be taught that you're really of not much value and that you should just stay down and keep your mouth shut. So the problem, of course, is that while you might survive in that household, um, you're not going to thrive in that household. You're not going to be able to grow and reach your potential. Um, and the reason is because in a household where the people are... Um, hurting one another physically or emotionally, putting each other down, um, devaluing one another. Um, they're creating and they're contributing to the creation of what I call an oppressive climate. And just like in you know real life, in a farming situation, in order for a plant to grow, it needs to have nutrients in the soil, right? It needs to be in an environment that is conducive to growth. Well, human beings are just like that in the sense that we need to be in an environment that's conducive to growth. And so one of the things we do here is teach people how to create environments that are conducive to growth for themselves and for others. Uh, that's step one because you're not going to be able to achieve any goals in life if you're not situated in an empowerment climate where things like goal achievement can happen. So. That's the first part. Uh, another piece of this is learning how to connect with others. Um, using that same farming analogy, a farmer might plant a seed, a gardener might plant a seed in the garden in very fertile soil, but if the seed cannot open up and reach out to connect with its environment, then that seed is not going to uh, develop any further. In the same way, we as people who are located in our own social environments with our friends and family, we must be able to open up to those people and to connect with them uh, through friendship and love and belonging. Because if we're not able to do that, then we're not going to be able to get a lot of our human needs met. Uh, human needs like for attention and respect and dignity and safety and support. Um, the only way to get those needs met is when you first have built a foundation of connection with other people. So here at Life Management Coaching Solutions, we're going to teach you how to maintain connection with others um, and also how to create empowerment climates. And then third, we're going to teach you how to manage your circumstances so that um, the way that you approach and respond to circumstances or situations um, which includes yourself, other people, the environment, uh, the way you relate. We're going to make sure that you, the way you manage those things is conducive to your own success and not just monetarily, 
um, but more so in, in regards to quality of life. Um, we want you to continue to experience a high quality of life no matter where you are, no matter what religion you are, no matter what uh, situation you're in in life, um, you can have a life worth living if you know how and when to apply certain skills and knowledge that we can help get you. So uh, I just wanted to give you that introduction and uh, if you'd like more information um, check out our website at www.flourishing-life.com. Thanks a lot.